So I want to talk about Jesse Lee Peterson. So he posted this video to his channel, Straight Pride Parade with Jesse Lee Peterson. This is an hour and 12 minute long live stream. And I haven't watched this yet. Like we're not going to watch all of this. But for those of you who don't know, there's a very big elephant in the room that Jesse Lee Peterson is not addressing. Uh, so let's just kind of like scan through this. And then I'll tell you why him being here at a straight pride parade is um, interesting. We'll, we'll say that. Here. Yeah, it still has a super chat open on the side. Yeah, I can, I'm moving it now. I just found okay. out how to do it. Cool. I'm a little bit confused because you see this abortion sign. The title is Straight Pride Parade. So I don't necessarily know what the relevance is here, but um, maybe it's a combination of anti-abortion and anti-gay. Who knows? Let me see that. So there's an all lives matter. Okay, okay. So anti-black lives matter. Yeah. We have, okay, no mask mandates. Folks, this is like a cocktail of all of the right wing um, priorities. Anti-gay, anti-abortion, anti-mask. Um, any predictions for what the next thing is going to be here? What's the next? Anti-critical race theory, perhaps? I'd imagine so. Lord forgive us and our nation. This poor kid, like when he's older, he's going to look back at this moment and feel so much cringe. Uh, I did. Like you can find the videos of me being baptized. Uh, actually, I saw the photographs of my baptismal. So cringeworthy. So cringeworthy. Um, and I had like frosted tips to make matters worse. Oh my God. It makes me want to crawl out of my skin. Nonetheless, um, I, I want to see, if, is there any commentary from Jess Lee Peterson here? Oh, look at this liberal wearing a mask. Spotted the liberal. Yeah. Nice. Right on, man. A pleasure. What's your name? Yeah. What's your name? Geraldo. Geraldo. Nice to meet you. So there's a anti-pedophilia. I just, I don't. <laughs> what is this? This is a straight pride parade. But there's like a lot of mixed messages here. Um, Jesus. Yeah, just chilling, hanging out. You called in before? Never. Okay. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, dang. I think he's homeless. You think he's, that sure guy's homeless? The proud boy? I don't think he's a proud boy. All right, so you a little recap, be. a little what just happened there. I think we just had, um, what just happened there? It was a. Uh, we had one of our boys here on this side. He got told by the cops that he couldn't have his metal water bottle. Just to right? let you know, you can't have big metal bo water bottles. Just and so he started cussing at them. You're not free to use metal. You have to use plastic right. and then throw it away. And so yeah. then he refused to. I mean, it's probably because you right-wing protesters are like hitting people with your uh, metal water, water bottle. So they view it as a weapon. I'm surprised they're like policing these at all. Uh, I, I want to know, like, what is the point of these protests? Here we go. So I just passed it. Uh, super straight. Yeah, super right on. straight, baby. Yeah, right super on. Super straight. Normal as yeah. normal as hail. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, if you're wearing a shirt that says "super straight," that's like one of the gayest things that you can do. You, <laughs> if you're straight, you don't broadcast that. I feel like that's that's so strange. Like, I don't know a single gay person who has a shirt that says like super duper gay i'm a six on the kinsey scale it just it doesn't make sense to me uh, and then we have this sign that says something about racist I, i'm genuinely confused i'm genuinely confused what is the point of this protest and where's jesse lee peterson it's just like is this just on his channel go to fucking china go to fucking romania go to bulgaria go to fucking i'll, I'll name all the fucking Chinese countries i i have thank you thank you thank you okay so these are the these are the libs who showed up to counter protest. Is Jesse Lee Peterson even here? Yeah, that one's for them, but they Don Don's group makes the distinction that they have the curved rainbow on yeah. their right to protest. Okay, without even seeing this guy, you can tell that he's an evangelical Christian. Captivating chameleon, thank you so much for the 90 bits. I really appreciate that. Oh, so he shows up later. Winston, have you seen this? Um I'm wondering, like is there because i'm at 
like the 50 minute mark like where's where's our boy jesse lee peterson oh there he is there he is okay okay this is what i came to see i am a huge fan of him so everyone who Man. hears this have a street pride event in your area we need to fight back across yeah. the country it's we need to stand up normal natural healthy sane that's our motto yeah. we're we're the voice of sanity in an insane world. sir this is a wendy's literally <laughs> Jesse, is, like, is what he's saying resonating with you? Because um, it's a little bit awkward. I, I'm not sure if people watching this know about Jesse Lee Peterson's history with heterosexuality. Uh, but uh, we'll, we'll just let's let's let it play a little bit. Let me go back a bit. Okay, so there's some more Jesse Lee Peterson. Let's watch. Let me see right here. What are you saying? Walk to me without looking back, though. Oh, so Ed Tifa's behind us. <laughs> That's not Antifa. Right? <laughs> that looks like Antifa. Yeah. yeah. Good. I thought he said Ed Chipa. <laughs> oh, that's the cops. <laughs> but the mob squad. <laughs> so they're telling us we gotta leave because Antifa came and there was a major Hello? breakout. They were spraying the stuff. Yeah. And uh, so they tell us we gotta leave, so we out of here. I tried to get Nick and Sammy and a Mexican boy arrested. Okay. But they didn't That's have on their jail. I can't understand a single thing that he's saying um, with the wind blowing. Maybe, like, I just want to, I want a little bit of context before I drop the bomb on you. Give you the elephant in the room that he is not going to address. To host uh, the uh, straight pride parade every year. Mm -hmm. And it's because of Don, this has happened. And we're all here. How do you feel about the cops showing off and all that? Well, the police are normally there to protect you. I, I can't. I can't. The fact that they're doing this interview in front of a Wendy's, for whatever reason, the aesthetic here, I, I'm just, I'm loving it so much. I'm really feeling this. Real clear. Yeah. yeah. But uh, suddenly we were attacked by our opposition. They put pepper spray on several of our people and it blinded them pretty badly. Um, but that gives them an excuse now. They've now. They figured out a way how to stop us. They how to stop the parade. They can pepper spray, and then bring the police in on their side, because the police dispersed everybody, in in uh, including us. We didn't spray them. We were spray. <laughs> this interview of these big trucks like going by. They're in front of a Wendy's. Oh my God! I love right wing media. How can you not be a fan of Jesse Lee Peterson? Oh my God. Great. Mm. So we were attacked, but it was irregardless of that, that the police went after everybody. So yeah. it gives them a good excuse to vacuum us off the street. Amazing. It's so what I, they did I, in I Charlottesville. Would... It's what they did in January 6th. They're going to yell. Yeah, so I would predict Center. our enemies now have a new method, which they discovered, which works very well. Yeah. They can attack us, and then the police will join them and Where vacuum everybody off, which is exactly yeah. what they want. Amazing. So, we lose our free speech oh, rights. It's just but we part just of the have battle. We keep coming down. We can't. We we'll keep coming back. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. We we're we're <laughs> having straight pride. It, it'll keep on going until we achieve victory over Planned Parenthood and and the enemies of our Christian nation. Right. And so everyone who oh, hears this, he's he's like saying all of this. He's trying to be profound. And Jesse Lee Peterson is not paying to anything. He'll just like chime in occasionally with an amazing, <laughs> so amazing. Good, bad, intern, internet left. Thank you so much for the tier one sub. Uh, I am really enjoying the straight pride parade here. Wow. Wow. Have a street pride I love how this person just like stops and they roll down their window and they just film it and they don't even care that they can, they can see this. Wow. In your area, we need to fight back across yeah. the country. It's, we need to stand up normal, natural, healthy, sane. That's our motto. Yeah. We're, we're the voice of sanity in an insane world insane nation he's and not we need paying to bring attention back christ sanity to our nation right on and these are some of the young ladies that show you up here how do you uh what do you think about the new bill that have in what happened how do you what do you think about uh, it? Uh, personally uh when i was went to get my citizenship to be a member of this country i studied the constitution and i remember the first <laughs> amendment right was very clear about us protesting in a street. Around, and locking, I, I just traffic. talked to the sergeant. They're locking the sorry. <laughs> so um, with that I'm being said, I if we had a good lawyer to sue that department, because because I know our mayor is a, a Democrat, a so liberal. He's a, she's it's a she, so it's a woman to start with. Yeah. She shouldn't even be there. Anywhere beyond where they're locking. Wow. Yes. What? Yeah. Wow. 
So this is a violation of a rights, but when it comes to Antifa, they'll protect them. And that tractor, I think only the mayor is allowed to give permission in our city. What's so, the tractor for? Oh, you mean that the black tractor? You notice yeah. that tractor down there? Oh, you, yeah, yeah. That, that was like that last year, too. So, think, think we're not this. I love how they're complaining that like the cops are protecting Antifa as if cops around the country aren't going mask off, like letting proud boys wreak havoc in cities. Uh, it, it, you know, it's nice for them to get a taste of what the left experiences if they are indeed being shut down. Having said that, though, I don't have enough context to, to actually deduce that that is the case. But I, I love the optics, love the aesthetic here. They're in front of a Wendy's. People are very clearly like making fun of them. Uh, it, this is... This is great. You have that like big truck pass by super loud. I love it so much. James from the internet. Thank you so much for the tier one sub. Really appreciate that. That bulldozer. JLP is my kink and I will not apologize. You like sluts. Cheers to that. Cheers to that. I, I'm really actually I'm very sad. I was telling someone I was trying to count how many protests I've done in this town. Yeah. And I can tell you at least twice a week for the last 38 years I have been out on the streets. That doesn't count Sacramento or anywhere else, nor Jesus the straight Christ. pride. So I've done thousands of these, yep. and I'm very sad that it's come to this. Don't you people want to wake up and understand that we are losing our liberties? Yep. It's time to stand up. Yep. Men first, please yep. lead us, guide us. Uh Is that a Tiny Tunes shirt? If so, then um, based. Okay. Uh, keep us separated. Protect us. That's your job. Women, come alongside of these men and thank them. Okay, I don't even know what she's saying, but you can tell just by her demeanor, and this is totally an ad hominem attack, but like the way she looks, you can tell that she has like single digit IQ. Like this is a crazy person i'm sure that there's like some viral video of her saying something racist you, you like you can just sense it i've seen so many of these videos with dumb fuck anti-vaxxers and crazy right wingers to where you can like they have a look in their face like a certain type of deadness in her eyes that just give it away uh but i don't know what this event is there's so many mixed messages so many right wing uh narratives that they're trying to push out here but long story short, Jesse Lee Peterson appeared at a straight pride parade, which is interesting given that um, I did a report on this about how mm, he might not necessarily be that straight. Mike, take it away. So <laughs> on his Twitter page, as you can see, you know, he he has all of his likes here and he liked a tweet from Donald Trump where Trump says, make America great again. And then if you scroll down a little bit more, you see that he liked a tweet from your daddy only fans, XXL boy, where there is a video of part two of a collaboration with Sean boy and Anthony D. Um, and basically this is the video of two men having gay sex and it is censored. But um, as you can see, um, there is one man eating out another man's booty hole. <laughs> gotcha, bitch. <laughs> I'm making myself he laugh. like this on his public account for his show. I know it's amazing. You date men too? I, 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 the fact that I, I'm laughing with myself is like it's ruining that. I'm dying. I can't. This is this is super meta. Okay, so just. <laughs> Jesse Lee Peterson on his public profile, he liked a video of the gayest sex you can imagine. Like even for me, right? I'm a homosexual. I'm married to a man. When I see that, I'm like, ooh, that's a bit much like Raiden in, Raiden in there. He likes a video of a man eating out another man's ass. And um, now he's going to a straight pride parade. When was this? Let me see. This was from uh, October of 2020. Not that long ago. I was thinking this was 2019. So less than a year ago, he's liking gay porn on his public Twitter profile. And then he's going to straight pride and letting some like weird boomer uh, evangelical nutcase explain, you know, the benefits of doing a straight pride in your country. Jesse, you're not straight. You're not straight. What are you doing? 
we know this, we saw this, and we're not going to let you live it down. What, what are you thinking? <laughs> oh my god, this is like, this is hilarious. This is hilarious. And he left that liked tweet up for hours. It was there for hours. And immediately after he realized that he liked that tweet, he set his account to private. Probably Beta. because he didn't scroll through and make sure that he didn't like any other gay porn tweets because he maybe thought that... I'm sorry, but if you're going to do like a cartoon of yourself, you have to get something that's more flattering than this. Alpha. Like, this is a weird picture of him. He was using his throwaway account, not logged into his public account. And um, I'm sure he's got to make sure everything is, is okay. So I don't know if he's even going to speak to this. But if he does speak to this, then I would imagine that he is... Uh, He's going to say he was either hacked or one of his interns or staffers did that and they've been fired because they're homosexuals and that's evil. But we all know what this is about. And I think that Lance from the Serfs put it best. How it started versus how it's going. I mean, there's only one word to explain all of this. It is amazing. Amazing! <laughs> now, obviously. Um, okay. Okay. Thank you, Mike, for that wonderful report. Amazing. So, uh, folks... The TLDR version is uh, almost a year later. Jesse Lee Peterson is still pretending to be straight. Are any of the comments going to point this out? Proud to be heterosexual. Let the straightening commence. Straight pride. Thank you, JLP. Amazing. Do none of them know? Maybe that's why he hasn't addressed it, because not enough of his fans know that he liked gay porn. I think that I'm going to have to uh, leave them a comment. <clears throat> Wait, is it is there an I in his name? No, there's no. Okay. I'm wondering if you remember the time you liked a video on your public Twitter account of a man eating another man's asshole just curious how this fits in with the straight thing you're oops you're trying i don't know i feel like i could do better than that but i just want him to know that we remember this so um yeah yeah, my comment will probably be removed or blocked, but folks, he can't remove or block this video, bitch. I got receipts. We know, Jesse, you will never live that down. So long as you keep doing these segments where you, like, are homophobic and you keep spreading uh, hatred, uh, I will remind people that you are indeed into the gayest of all porns. So amazing. Uh, the gayest of all gay porns. It's like... There's, you know, one to six. That's the Kinsey scale with six being the gayest. Uh, Jesse Lee Peterson, like the porn that he liked is a 10 on the Kinsey scale. Just FYI. So, yeah.